Hello, thank you so much for coming back and joining me for today's video. So today I'll be sharing with you the Essence Camouflage Plus Matte Full Coverage Concealer. So if you'd like to hear more about this product, price, see how it goes on and how it wears, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, I do upload a daily video on budget lifestyle. So it could be a cooking video, it could be an affordable drugstore concealer, it could be go shopping with me, it could be a little haul, so you never know. So make sure that you do subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. Make sure it's turned on to all so that way you are notified when I upload, which is daily. I also do a live stream every Sunday night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So yeah, I would love for you to be able to come on back and join whenever you'd like. So, okay, so I purchased these on Ulta. So these are $3.99. So very, very, very affordable um, full coverage concealer. That's its claim anyway. It's supposed to be waterproof and tattoo covering. So it's supposed to be like and out of this world coverage. So $3.99 for a full coverage concealer is amazing. Um, the other cheapest one that I can think of is the e.l.f. 16-hour um, camo and that one is $6. But yeah, so I picked up two shades. I got the shade um, 20 light ivory and 10 light rose. So I do have foundation on but I don't have any concealer. As you can see my under eyes are looking pretty pretty bad right now. So um, Essence is cruelty free. They don't test on animals and it's supposed to be waterproof and crease proof. So let's go ahead. So this is what the doe foot looks like. It looks like a little apple seed almost. Looks like a thicker concealer. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely a little bit of a thicker concealer. But okay. Has a little bit of a scent. It smells kind of like perfume. So if you don't like scented products, you probably won't like this. It is very, very light though. It's not over it's not overboard or anything, so okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and start blending it out with my foundation brush. Oh, wow. That is pretty nice coverage. It is, it spreads easier than the e.l.f. 16 hour. That one's a little bit hard to use for, for myself personally. This one does have really good coverage, but it's easy to blend out, so. Okay, that looks really, really nice. Wow, that's like, that is full coverage, wow, okay. Yeah, that spread out very, very nicely. Okay, I think I'm gonna go in with the lighter shade, which is the Light Rose. I'm gonna put that right here on my inner corners. Just wanna, you do get, it seems like you get quite a bit of product. You do get five milliliters or 0.16 fluid ounces. Just a little bit right there just to see if I can brighten up that area a little bit. Oh yeah, completely. Wow. My under eyes look amazing. Okay. I've noticed a, with, you know, with me personally, Essence products are kind of hit and miss for me. Um, but this seems awesome. Okay, so there we go. I'm going to get in pretty close. So I'm not seeing any creasing yet. I am going to go ahead and set it just because I do like to set my concealers. But it looks nice. Wow. Looks really, really nice. I think I'm going to go in with just a tiny bit more of the light ivory. I just want to see if I can just build up the coverage just a little bit. It is full coverage, but I had some serious, serious under eye circles. Okay, seems like it's layering fine. It's not getting patchy, which is awesome. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it's like taking up any of that previous layer that I put down. That looks really, really nice. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and set this down. I'm just gonna be using my Cody Airspun, and this powder is awesome, but it won't really add 
it doesn't really keep anything from creasing it just sets it so if it's gonna crease it's gonna crease no matter what but looks really really smooth Wow Okay, so concealer is blended and set. I think it looks really, really nice. It feels very lightweight. It doesn't feel heavy at all, but I think my under eyes look on point. So, okay, I'm gonna go finish up my makeup. Um, I'll touch base with you and show you what it's looking like, but so far I am really, really, really liking this this uh, Essence um, full cover, the camouflage, plus matte concealer. Heck yeah, so far I'm liking it, so it's really, really smooth. No creasing so far. Looks good. I'll see you guys here in just a sec. Hey, I'm back. So it's probably been about six or seven hours since I put on the concealer and I just wanted to show you what it's looking like. So I did do a lot of work and I have been crying a little. So let's see if it really is waterproof and crease proof and all that stuff. So Okay, so it's looking okay. Oh, this side though. That side's definitely creased. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, that side definitely creased. Okay, it looks like it did rub out. Uh, so a little bit of creasing. It does have minimal creasing. Um, coverage still looks really, really nice. Um, I don't see any kind of streaking or anything from crying. So, hmm, yeah, I think it still is looking really, really nice. Still feeling very, very lightweight, even though it's matte. And I did set it, set it pretty well. I don't see any, like, it's not looking powdery or super duper dry, which is nice. Um... One of the things I, it's not my favorite things about the uh, e.l.f. Camo Concealer is that it can look very, very dry on the under eye. I have combination skin. I couldn't even imagine someone that has dry under eyes using that concealer because it dries down very, very matte. This concealer is a matte concealer, but it's not like super duper duper matte. I mean, it still looks nice underneath the eye. I don't know why this one looks like it creased, but this one still looks smooth. That's so weird. Huh. But, I mean, honestly, I think they still... They both look really, really nice. It looks even. I don't see my blueness from my under eye circles coming out. Looks very lightweight. It doesn't look cakey or super makeup-y. So, okay. So, so far I'm liking it. Um, I definitely think it has amazing coverage. So let's get a little bit to pros and cons. So... Pros, amazing coverage, super duper affordable, $3.99. I mean, that is crazy deal, okay? Um, they are cruelty free. Um, and yeah, I think it's it looks very lightweight and it's not cakey. Some of the cons is there's only six shades. So color range is absolutely horrendous. It looks like there's like three light shades and then there are like three medium shades, um, like medium dark. So yeah, color range is pretty bad. Um, it is perfumed, so it does have a scent to it. It's a light scent, but there's still a scent to it. Um, and yeah, I mean, those are really the only two cons I can think of. I think it looks really, really nice under the under eyes. I actually prefer the way this looks to my e.l.f. camo concealer. This looks so much nicer. In my opinion, it looks a lot fresher, um, and it just it has really good coverage, but it looks, it's not super dry. Even though it creased a little bit underneath my right eye, I still think it looks really, really great. So yeah, I would definitely, um, maybe if you're in store, whatever, see if they have the Essence Camouflage Plus Matte Concealer. They're really, really nice. If you can find it in your shade, I would definitely recommend picking it up. They are great. Um, I'm glad I, because I was looking at the new um, like the new area of Ulta when I saw these I'm like I haven't tried an essence product in a while I love concealers so and it is pretty waterproof um, so yeah I think it looks really really nice so heck yes I found a really 
really nice, affordable, very affordable drugstore concealer. So I'm super duper happy about that. But anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this um, concealer video. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and share it. It shows me that you're enjoying the content, plus it's getting the word out on a very awesome, affordable, great concealer, which I know everyone in their life could still, you know, they probably could use a very, very affordable concealer. Uh, leave a comment down below. Um, have you tried the new Essence Camouflage Plus Matte Concealer? What did you think of it? Um, let me know down below in the comments. And don't forget, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all at Budget Glam Babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. I should have another video that should start autoplaying here very, very shortly. Or you can always click on one of the ones that will be popping up around the screen. So yeah, let's hang out a little bit longer. I'll see you here in just a sec.